Following Mersham's dramatic three-all draw at Isthmian South East League leaders Three Bridges last time out, it's back to drama of a different kind this afternoon. Knockout style football as the FA Trophy first qualifying round rears its head and its familiar opposition as Sutton Common Rovers make the short journey to the hybrid fitness stadium. Both these clubs survived relegation via winning their respective interdivisional playoff matches last season. Their Merston were shunted across to the South East Division, meaning these two couldn't spar for points this season. The Motesiders did beat Rovers here 3-0 last season and the same again would be welcomed by everyone associated with the club. Looking at the team news this afternoon, Merston boss Tony Reid has been boosted by the return of Ruben Collins at the heart of defence, so he'll slot alongside the ever-present Dean Gunner. Looking higher up the pitch, there are two debutants for Merston this afternoon. Kyle, Neil Gray and Josh Blaze Carr, wearing 10 and 11 respectively, will be looking to impress the home crowd. Strikers Craig Kingswell and Michael Dixon are back amongst the substitutes. As for the visitors, Sutton Common Rovers manager Sam Morgan has made two changes from the side that scored two added time goals to beat Guernsey 2-1 last week. Izzy Nazello and Nabil Ganham come back in for Danny Devine and Charlie Martin, while the home fans will recognise the likes of Jordan Wilson and Shio Blackwood in the visiting squad. Wilson squares the free kick out wide. Here's Nzello, gets it up and stands it up in towards the edge of the six yard area. Drops down. He's found a blue shirt and the shot is always rising. Nabil Ganam. Carter under pressure. Ref said saw nothing wrong with that. Wilson gets on with it. Tries to get Jenkins away. He's past Alexiu. It's opened up for him a little bit. Does he want to shoot? He tries to take on uh, Gunno. Stands tall and gets a good important foot in. Now the ball drops for Akpele. Neat footwork from him and he's got it out wide. Garbawi did it touch his hand. Referee says no. Here's Abnick coming forward from left back. It's opened up for him. He's had a crack as well, but didn't get enough uh, power on it. And that's Merson's first real shot in anger. 22 minutes on the clock. Merson now doing the same. Tony Reid's just imparting some words of encouragement. Aside from Michael Abnett's blaster from about 30 yards that was never on target. They've struggled to create any decent chances on James Dillon's goal. Blaise Cart does well to win the throw on. It's hooked away by Swaby. There's no offside flag here against Jenkins. Alexi does well to get back. It's still live with the winger and he couldn't get around his man. Here's Swaby, he's onside. Sutton Common Rovers building on that far side. Here's Ganam. Couldn't get past Gar uh, Oaks, I think it was. He's got past him now. The shot wasn't great, but Odin AK's managed to smuggle it out wide to Swaby. Looking to take on Abnett. It's onto his left foot. It's opened up for him. He's got a shot off as well, and Basie down to his left. Big strong hand, and that's the first real save of the afternoon coming on 41 minutes. There's a big clutch of players right on the goal line. It goes up towards that sort of area, headed away by Abnett. Nam looking to keep it alive for the visitors. He gets a shot off as well. Basie's there again. Strong right hand this time to deny Nabil Ganam. Carter does stand it up now. Akpele, he's onside and he's headed it weakly into the hands of Dylan. There was no offside flag though. This time Gunner and Collins and Alexiu have all come up for it as well. Carter's put it in quite flat. Whoa, what an effort from Gunner there. He caught it ever so well, but it was always rising. Not a bad effort there by the centre-back, to be fair. Caught it on the fall. Box. Headed away by Anzello. It's found its way all the way through to Odenaki, who drops it off for Swaby. Martin looking to make a run on the outside. Swaby's going on his own. He's surrounded by Amber Shirts, and he's picked one out. And open the scoring, Courtney Swaby. Breaks the deadlock in this FA Trophy first qualifying round. We've not had three minutes of the second half. He took it forward. No one put a challenge in in an amber shirt. And he just cracked it beyond the dive of Zach Basie to make it merge some nil. Sutton Common Rovers won. Throw goes into uh, Neil Gray, who's lost it again. He's not had much luck up there today with debutant. 
Odenake making a nuisance of himself and he beats Collins. Picks out Gandam on the edge of the box. Tricks his way in onto his left foot. Good save by Basie. For the follow-up's been put wide by Wilson. Play resumes. Gunner, right-footed, tries to change the angle, looking for Blaze Cart. Good touch from him. Can he get across? And he does. It's faced away and it's been put wide by Neil Gray. It's fizzed in by Swaby. Simeone's got it on target and it's dribbled its way in. Basie left on his backside and Rovers double their lead. Antonio Simeone, he barely caught it, but no one stopped the trajectory of the ball and it ended up inside the far corner. Swaby, good skill from the little man again, and he gets another shot off. Didn't dip quick enough from his point of view. Sweeps it out wide, looking for Blaze Carr, who's onside this time. What can he conjure up? He gets a shot off and straight down the throat of Dylan. Simeone under pressure from Mac Pele. He does get it down the line. Tanton. Lexi who does well to get a block on it. Here's Carda. Lays Carr. Gets it onto his left foot. Gets a shot off as well, but never on target. Gunnam through for Jenkins. Important foot in there by Alexiou and a second one, but Swaby gets it out wide. Here's Martin, fizzes it in low and it's turned in again by Odenake. And Merson's afternoon goes from bad to worse. They couldn't clear their lines 20 yards from the goal. Swaby nipped in, got it out wide to Martin, who just fizzed it across. And Odenake cushioned it home. And you can't really afford to lose another one now. Swaby makes a signal. He just stands it up towards the back post. It's missed Simeone. It's dropped for Lloyd. Important interception by Gunner. And it's been clattered wide by Jenkins at the far post. Now, Antonio Simeone standing over the free kick. Centre back's thinking about maybe having a crack. Is this 25 yards out? And he is. And it was way off target. Abnett looking to get Blaze Carr away again. He's been full of running the debutante this afternoon. And he's just about managed to get something on it here. He, he's in to the box, squares it for Dixon, just couldn't get any back lift to get a strike off. Here's Dixon, lets it roll across his body. Square for Holden, who takes it first time. Couldn't get enough curl on it, tried to use the outside of his boot. Here's Holden. Gobau, he's got oceans of space. Feeds it through for Dixon, who gets there. And he's won a corner. It's going to be an in-swinger from the far side. It goes in quite low. Akpele can't get anything on it. And the referee brings proceedings to a halt. And Merstam's journey in the FA Trophy this season falls at the first hurdle. Sutton Common Rovers got all three goals after the break. Courtney Swaby opened the scoring. Antonio Simeone got the second. And as Merstam huffed and puffed, Gabriel... Odin AK added a third with a simple finish inside the six yard box. Wasn't the home side's afternoon today. I've been James Barrett Sterling for Merson TV.